Today I've got for you guys a little trick with a golf ball. So let's get into that right now. Okay, so for this trick all you need is two golf balls or two things of similar size. Um, preferably different colored. Here we got like a little uh, practice softball. And you can also use things like ping pong balls or anything else that's generally this size would uh, would work pretty well. But for the explanation, I'm going to stick with the two golf balls. So here we go. Basically, you just need to have, learn how to palm a golf ball. This also works with sponge balls. So you can do this as a sponge ball transposition. Um, you palm it with the two bottom fingers and then these two fingers and thumb are open so that's what's throwing the ball back and forth and I'd usually do this for a spectator who's in front of me instead of looking down on top of it but basically what happens is when you're ready for the change you drop this and move this down with the thumb and get it palmed and then keep throwing it back and forth. So obviously you can see all the dirty work from up on top. If you are doing it from up on top, you kind of have to hold your hand like this so that the palm faces up and then you can do the change. I wouldn't really recommend it. It works best for a spectator who's in front and boom back and forth ready to change. I drop this one into the hand push down the golf ball with my thumb and then grab it into the palm all while I keep it in the same orientation and keep throwing this one back and forth so that's basically the change just real briefly throw back and forth drop and transfer down that's it I want to thank you guys for joining me this is a nice easy little trick that you guys can do for your friends um, I've done this at golf courses and things like that, and it's pretty crazy. Um, ping pong, if you got a friend who's really into ping pong, you can change the ping pong ball into a golf ball or something like that, or change the color of it. Just uh, have some fun with it, mess around with it, and let me know what you guys think in the comments. Be sure to like the video and subscribe for more videos and more tutorials on magic that you can do at home. Thanks, guys.